The Jupiter Exchange has upgraded from Dex Aggregator to Solana's all-in-one super app and in this video we will provide beginners with a complete tutorial on how to explore, swap and use all of the incredible features on the Jupiter super app. So before we begin don't forget to smash that like and subscribe button and let's dive straight into it. And to begin with, we are currently on the Jupyter website, which is jup.ag. Once we're here, we need to get ourselves logged in. As you can see, we've got the Jupyter Mobile option, which is their native wallet. And we provided a tutorial not too long ago, and we'll leave that in the description down below. Nonetheless, we've also got Phantom, Backpack, and many other Solana wallets we can use. And we've also got tutorials on each of them if you need to set one up. But we're going to be using our Phantom wallet. Once you've logged in, my friends, you'll be able to see that we've got our Solana assets ready to go. From here guys, as you can see we are now going to start exploring Jupiter and the first thing that we want to do is use the primary feature which is swapping. And for example guys you can see straight away that we are on the swapping section which we can see here. Now we can narrow it down just to swap if you wanted to like this and it will just remove the sidebar. However, once you're here guys, as you can see the top token that we want to swap is the token that we are going to be selling. If that was Solana, if that was Pengu, if that was Jupe, whatever it may be. Let's just say we're going to start selling some Solana tokens. The token token down below is the token that we now want to buy. So for example, it could be USDC, it could be, I don't know, Jup, it could be Fartcoin, whatever you guys want. Let's say, for example, we wanted to buy some Pengu tokens. All you would now do is choose an amount. So for example, if I did 0.1, you'll see that I'd swap $15.52 into Pengu. However, guys, how this works is because this is a DEX aggregator, it will aggregate the best swaps for us by scouting the Solana ecosystem through decentralized exchanges such as Radium or Orca for the best liquidity pool and best swap prices for us. So for example, guys, we can see down here that it is going through Metis, it is going through Goonfi, OpenBook, Medeora, X, Y, and Z. So all we're going to do is go and swap it. Boom, we are now going to confirm it. And in a matter of seconds, we'll have our Pengu tokens. Awesome, it's already done, guys. That's how quick, easy, and cheap it is. If you want to sell your tokens, you either A, click the reverse button, or B, manually select the token that you want to sell up top. If it was Pengu, if it was Wen, if it was Block, whatever you guys want. Next, for example, if I was to sell some Pengu tokens, maybe I wanted to sell, I don't know, 50 tokens, I could easily swap it back into Salt or any other token, and boom, you just click swap, and that's how you sell. So that's how you easily buy and sell by swapping on the Jupyter Exchange. After that, guys, we also have the trigger option, which enables you to set automatic buys or sells. So for example, if you believe that the Pengu token was going to hit $1, you could easily set it so that if the Pengu token hits $1, it will automatically sell and go straight into your wallet you won't have to come onto the decentralized exchange and do a manual swap you've also got recurring buy and this is basically dollar cost averaging this enables you to slowly buy into a cryptocurrency without again having to manually do it i'm not going to go through that in this video because we've done that in the past and the most popular feature is by far the swapping section Nonetheless, going back to the homepage, guys, you'll be able to see the other features. And from here on the left hand side, you can check out the pro section. Now, this isn't going to be for everyone. This is for those who are looking for those meme coins. And yes, this, of course, is going to be for a lot of people, but not something we will focus on in this video. For those who like to trade meme coins in the trenches, this is your go to place. Alpha scan will show you what's pumping, what's coming out soon, and what has bonded. You can also check out stocks, which is absolutely phenomenal. So, here, guys, you can check the top stocks of which are now tradable and live on the Solana network. For those who don't know, you can literally trade Tesla stocks, Google stocks, Apple stocks, any stock over on the Solana ecosystem. Now the fact that we've got it integrated, which is absolutely phenomenal. You can see the volume, the trades, the liquidity, and of course, if you want to get it, you head over here and you can easily buy any stock you like. Nonetheless, other than stocks, you can check out everything, guys, from cooking. This is basically your all-in-one data point of which you can find the best alpha possible. So here, guys, you'll be able to see the top protocols and launch pads within the Solana ecosystem. As we all know, Pump Fun is probably the leading one because, of course, it is just constant meme coins all day long. Let's Bonk Fun believe, guys, we have got some serious competition now. Even Jupiter has their own one called Jup Studio. However, guys, we're not going to focus on that. We all know Solana is the home of meme coins, but you can check out this section in order to find and scout out through the best meme coins on the Solana network. And I personally think this is phenomenal. It's not only just meme coins, but all sorts of altcoins, stocks, and everything that you will need to know in DeFi. However, guys, moving on. Back to the home page after that guys we've also got the perp section now this isn't going to be for everyone and especially not myself i don't know how to leverage trade i don't know how to realistically open up any kind of trade i am not confident with it at all 
However, for those who like to long and short the market, this is the perfect place to do so on Solana, where you can trade Solana, Ethereum, and wrapped Bitcoin all on the Jupiter exchange. Now, if you wanted to, guys, you can do this. You can do market and limit orders. I'm not going to show you how to do it, but if you would like a trading professional to show you how to open up trades, then of course, let us know in the comment section down below. And we have two legendary traders on our team, Richard and Manu, of which would happily, I'm pretty sure happily, show you how to trade. But guys, from here, we're now going to move on. This is very specific for those who want to trade. Nonetheless, we've also got the lending section. Now, this is absolutely awesome because it will be coming soon. And this is a new feature which I'm excited to use. I've personally registered for this, guys, and you're going to need to register in order to gain early access. Why am I doing this early access? Because basically they do airdrops once a year. Every single January, Jupiter do what are called the Jupiter event. And that is basically an airdrop for all of the loyal Jupiter users. However, I'm pretty sure this actually might be the last Jupiter out there. So maybe by using Jupiter Lend, we can get a bigger airdrop from Jup. However, guys, of course, I'll leave that down to you. You don't have to do this whatsoever, but I personally believe this will be a huge feature on their platform because as we can see, we've already got 2.43 million users registered and ready to lend assets on Solana. However, back to the homepage once again, guys, going through the super app, we've got the studio. This is a new section of which we briefly mentioned earlier. You can basically launch any cryptocurrency on the Solana network. Choose your adventure. If it's play, locked in, full send, custom, do whatever you want, guys. I'm not personally going to be doing this. I'm not looking to launch a token. However, some of you may be, if you're looking to launch a meme coin or something like that, this is the place for you guys. You can see that you will earn 50% of the swap fees, 50% of the LP pool after one one year and yes the token supply is vested i'm gonna leave it at that guys if that really is something you're looking to do we can show you through that in the future but honestly i don't see the point of launching a meme coin unless you're 100 serious about it because if you look at the solana ecosystem 99.99 percent of all meme coins created are scams and we don't want to get involved because of how easy it is to make a meme coin like you just see on this page However, from here, my friends, back to the super app, we are now going to move down into the mobile section. You guys know all about this Jupiter mobile because we provided you with a full tutorial. Now, if you would like to gain access to the awesome, amazing features on Jupiter directly through the palm of your hands, this is the place to do it. This is probably one of the coolest wallets that I've seen for Solana. And yes, it is only restricted to mobile right now. Who knows if they're going to be launching a desktop wallet. But for now, guys, all we can do is set up a Jupyter mobile wallet, if of course you want one. It's got a beautiful user interface. It's got all the features that you'd ever need. However, we're going to leave it short and sweet like that so you can check out the video on your own. Nonetheless, we've also got a portfolio section now, which is absolutely lovely because it enables us to take a look at everything that we are doing directly in our Solana wallet. So once it loads up, it already knows this is our wallet because, of course, we've got it on the platform logged in. Nonetheless, we can see how much JUP we are holding, how much JUP we are staking, how much Solana assets we have all in all. So the wallet breakdown here, which clears it up very nicely. 32% of this wallet is in JUP, which we can see here. We've got 25%, which is in USDC, but must be in DeFi protocols. We've got 12% in Solana, 9.4% in Pengu, 7.4% in WEN. And you can see the complete breakdown here. I'm not going to hide my wallet, guys. Why do I need to do that? I've got nothing to hide. However, you can see down here, guys, all of the things that I've participated in. That's ranging from Jupiter Exchange to Medelda to NX Finance to Lulo, Layer 3, and so many more, of which, yes, this is the wallet that we've been providing all those tutorials for. And yes, we have been qualifying for airdrops along the way. And if you wanted to, guys, you could very easily just go through all of your assets here. Sometimes you might have even forgotten about a platform that you've used in the past. And here it's going to show you exactly what you've done in those platforms and exactly how much you've got in those platforms so here guys basically just keep an eye on your portfolio keep up to date with the liquidity at x y and z as you can see here i've got out of range liquidity pools that i need to manage now otherwise i'm not going to be earning anything from it this is your overall dashboard you can always add more wallets if you wanted to you can even search for addresses as well in the search bar also, you've got the wallet manager section next to the dashboard of which you can save wallets, you can create groups. If, for example, you found a few meme coin traders on Solana that you're looking to track their activity, you can do that all on here, guys, making this a phenomenal tool for Solana meme coin traders or any trader or any Solana user for that kind. So moving on, guys, back to the Super App Hub. As we can see down below, we've got the onboarding section. So this is the easiest way to get started if you are brand new. They will show you how to create a wallet. They will show 
show you how to fund it with Solana tokens. But of course, you don't need to do this. We've got all the tutorials that you'd ever need on our channel. However, moving back over to the Super App homepage, what we're going to do from here, guys, is we're not going to go through the developer section because we are not developers. But what the next most important step is, guys, if you go to the more section, we want to go over to governance. Now, why are we going to go over to governance? Because basically, we have got some JIP tokens which we stake and we participate in the DAO. And the best part is recently we've just got the ASR rewards of which we can claim. So here, guys, you can see that I'm staking 817 JIP. Now, why am I doing this? Well, I earn rewards from the platform by participating in the DAO and I earn other awesome ecosystem rewards along the way. Now, by staking this, guys, you're obviously locking up your tokens and they are locked up for 30 days. So it does come with risk. This is completely optional if you do want to, of course, participate in the DAO. I personally do, and you can see that I've only participated in the last three governance proposals. I missed a few, but then the last ones I've done as well. I've done pretty much most of them. However, guys, if you see the view ASR reward, you'll see what I'm getting at. Down below, you can see how much I've earned this season. So for this ASR period, only JUP will be distributed as there is no LFG launchpad fee. When claiming your JUP, it will also be added directly to your stake. So I've already got a staked balance, but it's now going to add an extra 77 JUP tokens to my stake balance because of how much I've been participating in the DAO. The more you participate in the DAO, guys, the more rewards that you'll get. You can see that I've got three out of three. And of course, the more staked JUP that you have, the more rewards that you will receive. So I've got 77, it's not too bad, but it's a little bit of passive income of which we are getting on the Solana network. I have personally done it for the last year and a half, maybe even two years now. I can't even remember how long Jupiter has been out for. I'm pretty sure a year and a half. However, guys, this is exactly what I like to do. I like to participate in the DAO as well. If you wanted to, all you need to do is easily just stake Jup tokens, which you can obtain Jup tokens by going back over to the swapping section. Next, all you're going to do is choose Sol or whichever token to sell up top. Down below, if you want to buy some more Jup tokens, if we find the Jup token, as we can see, we've got Jup. I'm now going to choose an amount. It could be anything, guys. I'm just going to do a small amount as a tutorial. Let's say I did around $4 worth, which is 8.47 Jup. I'm now going to go back over to the voting section. I'm now going to choose an amount to stake. For example, if I wanted to stake, I don't know, 10 Jup tokens, you'll see that all I need to do is add to my stake. And boom, as you can see, we've now got 904 stake Jup. I'm going to slowly make my way to that thousand point and then I'll leave it at that probably. However, my friends, I've thoroughly enjoyed going through the Jupiter Exchange's new super app. They have absolutely upgraded the user interface to make it so much nicer. If, of course, you have any questions about this app, please let me know. However, guys, we've gone through everything that you need to know. But friends, thank you so much for tuning in. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. We've got so many other videos within the Solana ecosystem, whether that's tutorials for protocols such as Jupiter, or for example, airdrop tutorial opportunities of which you can find on our YouTube channel. That goes without saying that we've got other videos expanding out of the Solana ecosystem. And of course, we'll leave that for you guys to check out. But friends, thank you so much once again. We appreciate every single one of you and we can't wait to see you in the next video.